name is Laurence. And my name is Sam. We are the founders of Roadloft. Roadloft is a project that was born on the road from a passion for travel. We had already been traveling in a converted minivan for two years throughout Canada and the United States when we realized that we had found an economical way to travel within North America and we wanted to share it and let others know that they could do it too. Having a single everyday vehicle that turns into a camper whenever you want it, for us, it meant access to freedom. It's a way to get people out of their routine more often, to get away spontaneously, and above all, to encourage them to go out into nature without ever giving up their comfort. It's definitely our expertise in this type of trip, our knowledge of the real needs on the road that let us design a module that would optimize space as much as possible. We sought the expertise of an industrial designer with whom we work for over a year to ensure that our model would be strong, ergonomic, and super comfortable. Our goal was to create the ultimate camper out of an affordable vehicle that could also be used for everyday life. Also wanted a conversion that wouldn't be permanent. We also wanted a unit that would pack down very small when not in use and was very quick to set up. We wanted a bench seat, a table for four, a large bed with a very comfortable high density mattress, a functional kitchen and a lot of storage that was accessible at all times. We wanted a conversion that would not make concession. Being nature lovers, it was really important to us that we use healthy materials in the manufacturing process. We looked at the eco-friendly woods, safe finishing products, and that really added to the design challenge, but we were able to achieve it. The road laugh redefines camping and road trips. There's no time wasted on installation because everything is always in its place and ready to be used. In short, it really allows you to maximize your time out in nature and to enjoy it to the fullest. For us, it was truly the key to freedom. Oh,